Hello and welcome to our second tutorial about Prolog. Today we are going to write our first Prolog programming based on knowledge base. We know that Prolog consists of fact and rules. So in this tutorial we will see the overview of fact and later on we will see about the rules. So here there have some statement in English like Azim is male, Ohid is male. This is the English statement. So from here we will make the fact and we will write the prolog program. So in order to write the prolog program, open your any text editor like notepad or notepad plus plus any text editor uh, whichever you like. So you know I will use the notepad plus plus this one. So here we write the fact then we will save this file dot in dot pl extension. So let's have a look on the first one. First one is Azim is male. So what we can write here that if fact that uh, okay male male then bracket so who is the male actually Azim then we put full stop so we save this file we write one fact that male that means this Azim is male this is the one fact so we save this file have a look I save this in desktop save like okay let's say this pro dot must give the dot pl extension then this save now this is the prolog coding so next ohid is ohid is male so what we write here that it will be male ohid so the, we write the two options so uh, let's just close this one now let's open our SWI prolog so I am going to open the SWI prolog so after open this so we have to before that uh, like in C programming or Java we compile so here also we compile the file just now we created so what we have to do is go to the file and then consult then it will be open just you, wherever you save your file I save in desktop so let's go to the desktop so desktop let's find the prolog this one then just open so now we just run the program just now which is just in this location pro.pl we already compiled this file now we can uh, use this one so now let's complete our program so go to the file and in edit go edit in edit option just click on this so it will be open the uh, prolog editor uh, it's like text editor where you can write the prolog program so here we can uh, write the prolog program here see in this file have mail as in mail oh hey, just now we write so let's let's have a look on the next fact like jai is female and conka is female so what should be here that female jai and female conquer okay the next the number five Johari is man and Shira is women in the six so what should be here that okay man who is the man Johari 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 and man then who is the mm, uh, no it's not man it's the women so women uh, who is a Shira so we convert this all these six statement in prolog fact so this is actually the fact so what actually happen when we run this this uh, coding inside the okay so let's run it again we need to consult I mean we need to compile so select this one and then consult so we now consult now we can call the whatever fact we just now write here we either we can check it so it looks like a database we create a database for uh, so so that we can call here Th that's how the prolog actually works so here we can call like let's say that mail as in we are looking for actually either there have mail as or not so here yeah true this uh, this file I mean this compile file is uh, as is a mail so let's say uh, we just uh, change this one right okay female we can write that female then what we can female uh, as in we just test that it should be in false 
Why false? Because uh, this statement not true with anyone, right? So this female has been. That's how the product. This is called actually query. So we are doing some query uh, regarding search some fact from here. So this fact is false. That Azim is female. Azim is not a female. So next uh, we can write that. What we can write here? That male x. So actually x in prolog remember in prolog the variable defined with the capital letter that means either this is uh, x here is the capital letter so it is a variable so what it will be written actually it will be written that x equal to azim because uh, in male this fact he will look for the fact that male azim right so x replaced to azim so it will be display azim so when you want to uh, watch the more information either they, this fact still have or not i mean there are male one two so just put semicolon when you put this semicolon and it will be complete the query that because we have another male which is ohid so we get the male x which is azim and ohid so in next let's uh, let's write the man johari uh, either we just replace with y man y so who, what should be the query that y equal to johari because in man y it's only have one so this showing one time so it's have two times so we have to uh, get the result by remember by this semicolon and one more fact maybe you have been noticed that we have been put after the fact whatever we looking for after the query we always put full stop so in prolog don't forget the put the full stop so from this tutorial i think uh, you practice some more you can write your own uh, own coding and in fact um, i'll provide some code in below of this video just visit my website if you are watching in, on youtube then you will get some code example code where you can practice so Thank you guys. That's all from our today tutorial. So see you guys in next tutorial.